Hey guys, in this lesson I would like to teach you how to find the slope and coordinates of the x and y intercept points for any linear equation, such as the one I have here, 3x plus 2y equals 6. And as a, in the meanwhile, I'm going to show you also how to uh, put this equation into standard form. So, in order to find the x and y intercept points, we need to, for the x intercept, set y equal to 0. And for the y-intercept, set x equal to 0. So if we go ahead and, let's go ahead and find the x-intercept point first. So in this equation, I'm going to plug in y equals 0. I'm going to get 3x equals 6. Therefore, x equals 2. So the x-intercept for this equation is going to be 2, 0. I got the 0 from here. The y-intercept can be found by plugging in x equals 0 into this equation. So we're going to get 2y equals 6. Therefore, y equals 3. So the point 0, 3 is the y-intercept. Now, to find the slope of this equation is a little bit more tricky. And along the way, I want to find the standard form of the line. So, the standard form of, of a line is y equals mx plus b. Here, b is the y-intercept and m is the slope. We need to write this equation in standard form. So, if I go ahead and subtract 3x from both sides of the equation, I'm going to get 2y equals 6 minus 3x. If I divide the entire equation by 2, I get y equals 3 minus 3 halves x. Now, if I just switch these two, I get y equals negative 3 halves x plus 3. You'll see now that I've written this equation right here in a completely different form with the rules of algebra. into standard form. Here I can immediately read off m, which is my slope, is this negative 3 halves, and my y-intercept b, which is 3, which makes sense, because I already had previously derived that my y-intercept should be 0, 3. So therefore my slope, which is m, is just negative 3 halves. Pretty easy, huh?